Hey guys and welcome back to the Sims 4 Ultimate Decades Legacy. So today we're going to be aging up the twins into uh, children because I'm tired of them being toddlers mainly and I want to have like a new, a new life stage to play with. It is, I believe it's 1305, yeah. So it's a whole new year. It's still thunderstorming per usual in summer. But I thought it would be a lot of fun to just get these guys aged up. And there's not really a way that I have found to make a cake while being off the grid and using the Yield Cookbook mod. So I'm probably just going to go into cast and age them up because I think that'll be the easiest way. I was thinking of doing it like MC Command Center. I just think it might be a little... Oh my god, stop. They're so cute. Might be a little glitchy. Oh my god, he loves his sister. <laughs> so cute. Oh yeah. I sent Elric out to go hunting while it was not storming outside and now it is. So yeah, fun time. Oh, also one of the chickens died. <laughs> oh, why are there hearts? Is, is that always a thing? Mm, unclear. But yeah, I, one of the chickens died and the Grim Reaper came like late last night to come get him. I think my cow is also getting old. So I'm not sure how long we have with that. But the two, the rooster and the hen that are in there now are relatively young. I, I feel like we got them kind of recently. So they should live for quite some time. Oh, are you so scared? Why are you out here sleeping? Honey, you have, I specifically got you an enclosure with like an actual roof. And you're going to stand out here in the rain. Yeah, that sounds about right. Um, but I guess, do we just go ahead and eat them up? Like... I kind of want to. Uh, let's turn on testing sheets. Oh, I spelled that wrong. There we go. Um, oh, I need full edit mode, actually. All right. Um, you know what? Yeah, let's just... Let, oh my god, everything's breaking. Let's just do it. Let's just go ahead and age up the twins. Alrighty, guys. The twins are all aged up and they are so cute. This is Oliver. He is a ham. Um, this is the everyday outfit I gave him. I haven't really given any... Oh, sorry. This is the... I mean, they're the same, but this is the everyday outfit I gave him. I've not really given any of them shoes because I don't really have any, like, cute medieval shoes just yet. But that's his outfit, and then this is Anora. This is her everyday outfit. I think she looks adorable. And then I kind of wanted to give Petra a new outfit. I downloaded a couple of new things, and we are making a decent amount of money. Now we have a relationship with the Royals, so I think we could probably get like one new outfit. Is that too, that looks a little too fancy maybe. What other colors are there? Mm, that's way too fancy. What about this? Oh, well, that's cute. This could be like something she put together herself. Like she sewed herself. And it's getting to be like a little cooler out. I mean, it's summer right now, but it will be getting a little bit cooler out soon. Oh, what about this one? Uh, or this one? No, I think I like the first one. Go back. Yeah, I really like this one. The colors are really nice. Do I want to change her hair? Mm, I really like the hair that she has now. Yeah, I kind of want to keep her hair the same. So that is everybody's new makeover looks. I think everyone looks adorable. I cannot wait to have more interactions and if, like develop these relationships with the kids now that they can actually do things. Oh, I need to buy beds. <laughs> Where am I going to put those beds? I did not think this through. Um, <laughs> I may have to put the beds in with Grandma Mira just for a little while because the next time it tells me that Mira's gonna pass away, I'm just gonna let it happen. Because my main goal was wanting her to hang out with the kids. But look! Oh my gosh, everyone is so cute! And then we'll wait a while before we age up Alexander because he has eight days. So yeah, he has he has some time. That'll be okay. He has, he has a bit of time. What are you doing? <laughs> I don't even, what happened to the sink? Uh, here, do you want to come repair that? Get that all cleaned up. You also will need a bath, so let's go do that. Um, where is Nora? Oh, she's down here playing with her spoon toy. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I love the new outfits. I think the colors are nice. Before, I had everybody as a more neutral, just because... We were peasants, we probably could just uh, like be able to get the cloth. And now we have more areas to 
get color into our life and we're able to make dyes like we're able to actually cook up dyes so and we have the sheep for wool so it's it works out unfortunately it's like a dark and stormy night so there's not much that we can do outside today but hopefully the weather is a little bit better tomorrow oh i need to eat that stuff i've decided to wait on changing the garden because it's gonna be full in four days so there wasn't much reason for me to like go through and completely change out everything when they're gonna be coming back into season soon so I just left them how they are what are you working on little one what the umbrella I swear oh are you scared sweetie yeah the thunderstorms in this game can be can be kind of intense uh, Grandma, do you want to come and feed her? I would very much appreciate that. What the? <laughs> he just left all this here. We're going to throw that away, and you can mop this up because it's your mess that you made. Oh, yeah, let's um figure out the bed situation really quick. Um, so I only need the two toddler beds, so I'm going to sell that one. I don't even... Were there bunk beds back then? Is that a thing? Okay, so funny enough, I actually had some custom content of bunk beds, so I'm just going to use it. So it's basically just the regular bed, but in a bunk bed format. Um, honestly, there's not much else that I could fit in this room. I downloaded some new like toys and things for them to use. We can put a little bear in here, I guess. Let's put that like over there in case they want to play with the bear. Um, I think that's probably all that I can fit in here, at least until Grandma Mira passes away and then we'll have a little bit more space. But that'll do for now. And I think I'm going to give Anora the top bunk assign you to that bed and then your brother oh can i not assign this bed no it's all right then at least she gets the top bunk oh thank you for doing that sweetheart i really appreciate that just be careful going out in the storm oh what's everybody doing and everyone's just like staring at the poor baby louise is just like why are people just looking at me yeah oh and then we just put her right back yeah that's fair Hopefully we don't have any more children. Our household is full right now, but who knows what shenanigans they'll get into once uh, their grandma passes away. Now that the kids are aged up, they can actually help with chores around the house and around the farm, which is going to be so nice. Here, honey, why don't you come over? Um, can you clean these guys? Um, oh, these ones you can't clean. That's totally fine. Dad can, or mom can actually do that because she's in the middle of her chores. So we'll clean you, and we'll clean you. Do we have any laundry that needs to be done? Oh yeah, we'll definitely do that too. Add to wash tub. Oh no, what happened over here? Was he not a fan of being cleaned? Here, is he in a better mood? He is. Go ahead and mount him. Let's get some riding done today. The storm was so bad yesterday that we really couldn't go out and do anything with the horse. I felt really bad. Um, why don't you also get the garden? Okay, go ahead and mount. Does he not want to be mounted? Oh, oh God, the glitches. There we go. Oh, I probably should have had him, you know, clean up and shower, but it's okay. Why don't we go for a energized ride? Get that riding skill up. That way we can try to teach our kids how to ride the horse as well. That way if he has some knowledge, he can teach them. Have fun. What is this? What, what, is, what is that? Was one of our plants struck by lightning? Is that what that is? Okay. Interesting. We'll throw that away, I guess. How are you doing with your chores as well, my dear? It's so weird not like having her be pregnant for once. <laughs> I feel like she, every time that she had a kid, she was like immediately pregnant again. Let's take a quick shower. Oh, we need to collect some water. I cannot forget to keep doing that. Where's our little... There it is. Gather water. That way we don't run out. And then, do we have any honey that we can make into... Oh, yeah, I have a bunch of honey. Okay. 
we might need to call over Sir Thomas again because we have so much stuff that needs to be sold. We've also not been to the castle in a while. I'm, I'm sure the queen has probably had her baby by now. So I think that maybe in the next video we'll go by the castle and bring one of our kids with us so they can kind of see what it's like to go to the royal castle. We can bring both of our kids, actually. both, And that way they can maybe meet the young prince and princess and see if they've aged up. So yeah, maybe we'll do that in the next video. Go ahead and shower, my dear. Although you don't fully need one, but it's okay. You're going to go out and collect water. Oh, we need to collect the honey. Uh, the clothes should be clean by now, Grandma. I love how they just walk up and yell at you. It's so funny. Yeah, you should be good to go. Um, we are going to unload and move to the clothesline. There we go. Look at us getting all of our chores done. Do I have anything that I don't need in here? Normal quality horse manure. I could use that as fertilizer. Oh, I had her make some raspberry mead. Oh, that actually sounds kind of good. I'm not a mead person. I've had mead once before in my life. I was not a huge fan of it. It did not taste great to me. But I think it was just like regular mead, not, not like flavored or anything. I feel like flavored mead would probably be a lot better. Are you enjoying your food? How is your ride going? <laughs> He's so uncomfortable. He's so close to the next level, though. They both they both are. Let's get you the next level, and then you guys can circle back home. Have fun. Do your thing. All right, darling. Go. Did you get the water? I think she did. Great. Hello. What are you guys up to? Oh, God. <laughs> Please don't fall. She, like, falls and breaks her like, Oh, can the kids go out, like, foraging or anything? Out of curiosity. Let's see. Oh, they can go for a stroll or pick some flowers. And they can go to the village, visit the village physician, go to the meat market, the shop. Ooh, the wandering minstrel. Go to the theater. Ooh, we definitely have enough money to go to the theater. Maybe we can send, maybe we'll send both kids to the theater. Um... Take your brother. I think I just want to send you two. And it's just a rabbit hole, but at least they can go and like do something. Awesome. They got the next level. So they are both level three. You guys can make your way back home. Apparently we're saying goodbye to someone. Uh, canter back this way. Oh no, my horse is in a bad mood. Oh, he's feeling tense. Is it because he's been ridden for too long? That actually might be why. Okay, we're going back home. It's okay. We got a nice ride out of that. Got our level up. Oh, look at Grandma! Leonard. You go, girl. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Yes, do all of the art. Oh, there's poop back there. I just find, like, random pieces of poop everywhere. Go ahead and clean that up. No rush, though. You can kind of hang out and do what you want to. How are you doing, little one? You're the... Only one stuck in the house. Oh, well, you and your sister are stuck in the house. Ooh, are you potty trained yet by chance? Let's actually go ahead and put you on there. Get you potty trained. Oh, no, and you're stinking too. Hold on, sweetie. We'll get you cleaned up. Are you guys back home yet? You are. Fantastic. So go ahead and dismount velvet. You need to get yourself all cleaned up. Go and take a shower. You are smelling so bad. This poor horse has to deal with your funk the whole time you're on your ride. That's sad. There you go, honey. You can have a bit of... Oh, oh. Oh, okay. That's that's also cool. We'll uh, get that cleaned up. But today was pretty eventful. We aged up the kids. We got some makeovers. I love Petra's new outfit. It looks so good on her. So nice and vibrant. I love that very much. But I think this is a good place to wrap things up for today. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up. Leave all your comments and suggestions down below. Also, if you're new, please don't forget to subscribe. And I will speak with you all next time. Bye, guys.